Hello, it's Francisco. So you made this great video and you want to share it with the rest of the world, but how? You need YouTube. YouTube is a movie theater of the internet where every online video ever worth mentioning resides, including yours. YouTube allows you to share your video with anyone who has an internet connection and a computer or a video cell phone. Viewers can comment on your video, rate it, email it, and add it to their blogs, websites, MySpace, and Facebook accounts. It's very powerful and you can potentially connect to millions of viewers. Putting your video on YouTube is fairly easy, but there are a few tricks that you will need to know. First, you will need to sign up for an account on YouTube. On your computer, go to www.youtube.com and click on the sign up button on the top right. Here, fill in your information for a new YouTube account and click create my account. Or if you have a Google account like Gmail, you can sign in using that login information to the left of the sign in screen. Once you sign up for an account, YouTube will send you an email to verify that you've entered your real email. Just open up that email and click confirm your email address. Now you have a YouTube account. We need to put your video onto YouTube. So go back to YouTube and click the gold upload button on the upper right hand side. Uploading means that your video is being transferred from your computer to YouTube. If it asks for your login information, this is where you enter your YouTube username and password that you just created. This next page is where you send your video directly to YouTube. YouTube can accept files up to one gigabyte in size and up to 10 minutes in length. However, we recommend that your video is a lot smaller and shorter than that. We recommend that you export your video from your editing program as either a Windows Media Video for PC users or QuickTime for Apple users. You should use a setup that is called LAN or Intranet, but most settings for the web will work as well. For more information on this, view our lesson on how to export your video for web in your editing program course. You should save your video to your desktop so you can easily find it for uploading. Once your video is ready, click on the Browse button and locate your video, which should be either on your desktop or wherever you saved it. Click Upload Video button. This will begin the transfer to YouTube. You can track the progress of your upload on the website, but make sure you don't close your browser while it's uploading. The next web page that will come up is the Video Upload page. And this is where you enter in all the information that allows people to identify your video. There are four important pieces of information here that you need to fill out. The title, description, tags, and category. These pieces of information allow viewers to find your unique video on a specific subject out of the millions and millions of videos on YouTube. It's really important to be specific and precise with this information. For your title, I recommend that you call your video something intriguing interesting or exciting, something that screams out, you have to see this video. However, you want to make sure your title is accurate to your content because if viewers are disappointed, they will rate your video poorly, which means you'll have fewer viewers in the future. Next is the description. This is where you want to set up the basics of your story. Who's the character? Where does it take place? And why should the viewer care? Don't give away the ending here, but instead use it to create a mystery or a sense of excitement. After the description is tags, which is incredibly important. Tags are keywords that describe the content of your video. This allows people to search and find your content. So for instance, if your video is on fishing for swordfish in Florida, your tags would include swordfish, Florida, ocean, fishing, boating, fish, and more. But be careful. Don't add too many tags, especially ones that don't have much to do with your video, because this will actually hurt your chances of people finding your video. So keep your tags as specific as possible and don't try to stretch it. 
And the last area is the category, which places your video in a specific area of interest, such as music or pets, animals. Place your video to the closest category to your subject. Below the box with your video information, you have the ability to change sharing options. These allow you to fine tune who can see your video and how they interact with it. For now, we recommend that you leave them as they are, but feel free to explore these options. Once it's uploaded, it will take about 20 minutes before you can view the video on YouTube. You'll be able to see it in My Videos, which you can find under your account. If you click on your video, you will have several options to share it. The easiest way is by clicking the Share button under the video, then selecting Send Video. Here you can type in an email and message, then send your video directly to that person. Now you have your video out there in the world, ready for you to start sharing and building an audience. And if you'd like to learn more on how to build an audience, view our upcoming course on podcasting.